Hi everyone and welcome to week number two of my 13 weeks to Halloween countdown. So every Sunday I'm coming on to do a page in my Halloween book. This is the front cover that I made um, in the 12 month of Halloween collaboration. Uh, and then last week on week one we made the uh, Monster Lab uh, page which I absolutely love still. Um, this week, week two, making page two, um, I was going through my big box of Halloween stuff and I came across um, these die cuts. They were kind of just um, like flat against the thing and they've been staring at me for a while. So I thought I could use these die cuts. So I'm kind of going down a skull kind of theme. And then clearly I've cut them out um, in some pastel colours. Maybe I was doing a bit of pastel Halloween. Um... I don't know <laughs> it's been a while and then I just pulled out some more I've got some sugar skulls here I've got a skeleton hand Um, I love these bows I want to use some bows as accessories I've got the holographic um sticker skulls as well and then that kind of made me see these um I've got some eyeballs because I've got this really cute paper and this was a stamping up paper that the lovely Jane uh, gifted to me in uh, the, my giveaway last year and then uh, I was thinking of like I've got this bag of chains that I used to make the purses and I was like it was just sat there out my desk and then all I could get in my head was rattling them bones <laughs> so I thought okay um maybe I'll use that I don't know so we'll just sort of see how what what happens and what um how this all plans out um and then i don't know what i'll use if i use everything or not but i tried to anyway so um let's just get crafting <laughs> Okay, so here is the final um, art page. Um, I've got a little bit over the top with the holographic, so I apologise if I'm glaring you, but I think it absolutely worked. I'm loving skeletons and holographic. Um, I haven't gone too bulky this time. Um, I know I, I've got a chain going through there and stuff, um, but it is, in comparison, a lot more flatter. Um, I didn't trust myself to freehand with the sugar skull here but I didn't want to leave it plain either because it just didn't work well so I did a rough uh, little uh, smile I guess um, I stuck them eyes behind it just to give it a little bit of life and character and then I just used my enamel dots and stickers and like the hearts and stuff just to um, play around with, you know, I sort of use this as a reference kind of thing. And then I added this pop of lime green with the bow and I chose the lime green um, chain. I didn't really want to go down the pastel route and I was going to pick out like the purple and the raven in the background, but I decided against that. I really do like that lime green um, with the black and the holographic and everything. And then just out of pure luck, this little uh, lime green flower was just floating around on my desk. I thought, oh wow, I could really just add that in there. Um, got my spooky skeleton hand just sort of 
uh, going through the rings of this chain and I use my light bulb clips to attach the chain to the paper. I wanted to give it a little bit of movement still uh, but then it was giving it a bit too much movement it was covering up my skull so I just added a little tiniest dab of hot glue there. I really love these puffy uh, stickers, these holographic skulls, they work really well with this. I know Boo is usually more associated with ghosts, but I thought it worked really well as a sentiment on this page. So I'm really, really happy with this. I'm going to pop it, it, pot it, pop, pop, pop it, <laughs> pop it, <laughs> put it in the back of my uh, page. So it'll be my second page in the album and um, we'll be back next Sunday to do another Halloween page. If you want to carry on and make things yourself or you want to do art pages or something in the run up to Halloween and you're not part of a collaboration, you can use my hashtag. I would love to see what you're making. I do love Halloween crafting. Um, so yeah, so thanks for watching. Take care everyone. See you soon. Bye.